Hello, I'm Connie Talbot, and I'm welcoming you here to High Hollow Pottery, along with my guests, Stephen Proctor, Tiffany Hilton, and Ellen Grenadier. You can find links to their workshops on this site. I've been working, making pottery all summer long, lots of cooking pots and little Italian oil lamps, which you um, can have, a, they have a wick and you can burn oil olive oil in them. Let's go see what's happening in the pottery. Stephen's curious. What you doing? <laughs> I'm throwing a tagine. What's that? A large cooking pot. Um, for, that you use on a stove top. We're going to watch you do that for a sec, and then we're going to come in and see the finished product. You got one to show us? I've got a few that are in process up there that are drying out. I'm, this is just the beginning. I'm just making the great big bottom to it. If you come back in a little while, maybe I'll, sh maybe I'll show you it for, it for the demo video. I'll, I'll, All right. I'll do the... Uh, we're just curious here. How much does the bottom of one of these things weigh? It's this, you start with eight pounds of clay. For this, this is a large one. Mm -hmm. It's about 14 inches. And it'll have, um, it'll be about four, five inches tall. And then it'll have a, a lid that goes up like a Moroccan tagine. Tagine is the name of the pot itself? Tagine is a, the word for pot and in Morocco so it is so that the name tagine for the, the food is after the pot that it's cooked in. Mm -hmm. So there's think of something like a lamb tagine. Yeah. Let's head over to the showroom now to see some Italian olive oil lamps which will come with a string wick. You can see all these others are cooking pots, which will be on my website with descriptions and prices. You're welcome to connect with me with questions or to schedule a video tour until it's safe to meet in person. A portion of all the sales from the tour will go to Art Supplies for Kids in Public Schools, ASK, Ask Hilltown 6. Remember, Black Lives Matter. The flame still burns. Thank you for visiting. Hope to see you next year.